against Russian hacking during the 2016 election. Crown Force Ellis Sogamonian is live for us outside the Russian consulate uh, here in San Francisco. Ella, what have you seen so far? Well, we've seen Russian diplomats come and go from this consulate office here in San Francisco all day long, but they've made no comment to media. And I actually was inside last week. I met with a spokesperson who let me know that if we ever had a question that he would be available to answer. But it seems that tonight it's a different story. I asked to speak with the Russian consulate spokesperson I met with inside last week, only to be denied and instructed to call him instead. But all day, no answer or voicemail option. Thursday, San Francisco's Russian diplomats kept to themselves after an order from President Obama for 35 consulate members to leave the country and take their families with them. No more comments. Thank you. Help. The orders are a direct response to Obama believing Russian operatives hacked the U.S. presidential election. But some members of the Russian community aren't convinced. I'm not sure what's, uh, what's the truth is. So. Uh... One side says one thing, another side says another thing. So you, everyone has to make his make up his mind on his own. I'm not sure what's happening behind the scenes. I need proof, like scientists. So because I need the facts, I don't need emotions. Instead, they fear this may be the beginning of many more sanctions to come. I mean, this is like sanctions. It's not good. People struggling. They don't have enough food. I remember those times when I didn't have enough food and I wear the same clothes like everybody else. It wasn't nice. And I don't want to repeat that for anyone. I just hope everything, you know, calms down. And hope what is left of the relationship between the two nations doesn't deteriorate further. And while we've had no response out here, the official consulate office over in D.C. says to expect a response to these sanctions tomorrow. Live in San Francisco, Ella Sugamonian, Cron4 News. Thanks, Ella. Meanwhile, the Russian government, they reacted with scorn to the Obama administration's moves. A Kremlin spokesman called me a